What's up, HasFit Tribe? It's your personal trainer, Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia, and this is an arms and shoulders workout. The only equipment required for today's routine is a pair of dumbbells, and the weight that you choose will be completely dependent on your fitness level. In part one, we're gonna completely blast those biceps and triceps. And in part two, we're gonna work on those shoulders. If you're ready to get started, let's do it. We're gonna get started with a bicep superset and we're gonna do two rounds of it. Our first move is gonna be a dumbbell curl and we're gonna perform 12 repetitions. So go ahead and grab the appropriate weight for you today. We're gonna have our feet shoulder width apart, shoulders are back, good posture. We're gonna have your palms facing forward. Now in a controlled fashion, go ahead and curl all the way up and all the way down. Performing 12 repetitions in total I really want you to also focus on controlling that descent, that lowering portion of the lift is just as important as the way up, especially in these strength training and muscle building routines. Making sure to breathe and we're inhaling on the way down, exhaling on the way up. Excellent, we're gonna burn these biceps out, the superset here is just the first move. Shoulders stay back, good posture. Three more. Almost done with these 12. Nice work, here we go, last two. And last one, all the way up. And then now let's come down until we get to those elbows 90 degrees and we're gonna pulse right here at that 90 degree elbow flexion. Just little pulses for 15 seconds. That's it, feel that burn. Already feeling it working on this first one. And three, two, one. Now we're gonna hold, don't move, don't drop those arms, just hold in that position right there for 15 seconds. We're burning right there with you, getting that lactic acid going. Not much longer, five more seconds. Come on, hold it tough, hold it tough. Three, two, one, zero. Whoo, way to get it started. All right, set those dumbbells down. Shake your arms out. We're gonna go through that sequence one more time. 15 second break here, so that break's gonna go by fast. That was awesome. That was good, she liked it. If you're unable to control the movement up and down on the bicep curl, you might be using a little bit too much weight. Feel free to mix it up if you need to. That's right, drop right. the weight if you need to. Here we go. Three, two, one, begin. Palms are up, on the way up and on the way down. Again, nice and controlled. You definitely don't want to be swinging to get the dumbbells up to yeah, your shoulders. Yeah, we don't want to use momentum on this one. Really want those muscles to work. We don't want your joints and uh, cartilage, ligaments, tendons, etc., to all take over. Good. Again, maintaining proper form, proper posture. You are halfway through. That's it. Come on, stay tough, everybody. Six more. And we're gonna feel a lot of lactic acid today. That's that burning sensation. You gotta remember, that's just that fuel that your muscles are using. And it creates that nerve response, that burn. But you're stronger than that burn. You can push past it right here. Two more. There we go. Feeling good, my arms are feeling great already. Last one, all the way up. And let's bring them down to 90 right here. Boom. 15 seconds, hold 15 it. 15 seconds on the pulse. There it is, come on. Good, just little one to two inch range of motions. Trust us, we're smiling, but our arms are burning too. Come on. Three, two, one, and hold. hold. That's it. Whew. Only two sets of these, so this is it right here. Keep fighting, everybody. Come on. Fight through that burn. We're almost there. It'll be worth it. Go to your happy place. That's Five it. more seconds. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one, and break. Whew, excellent. 
And for our next superset, now it's time to go after those triceps. Similar system to the first time, we're gonna start with a lying tricep extension for 12 repetitions, finding an appropriate weight down flat on our backs with our dumbbells. And if you have a bench, you can probably pull yeah, that out for these. A bench or a stability ball, you could also use it for these. We're just using the floor today. All right, palms are facing inward and we're gonna only bend at those elbows, allowing the dumbbells to slowly come down into the elbows, get to a 90 degree angle, reverse direction, and back up. Really isolating your triceps on this one. And you're hitting 12 repetitions. Again, all the way up, all the way down. Concentrating on controlling the move throughout. Really trying to eliminate that momentum. We're gonna go back and forth between those biceps and triceps today while one's resting, the other's working, and vice versa. Halfway through. That's it. Keep pushing, keep moving. Make sure to breathe in, inhale on the way down. Exhale as you push up through the hardest part of the movement. Good, good, good. Keep it up, everybody. Come on, focus on what motivates you, what brought you here today. So it's gonna get you through that burn. All right, here's your last one right here. And on the way up, we're gonna stop at that 90 degree angle and it's time to pulse. Again, like I said, very similar to that first move. If you need to change up your weight, feel free to do so. Little 15 second pulses, keep it up. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one, and oh, hold. Oh, that's it. Whoo wee, you see I'm shaking too. That's it, keep those elbows bent at that 90. Fight through it, come on, we're almost there. 10 more seconds, guys. Come on, you got it, you got it. Don't quit, Five, don't quit. Four, three, two, one, break. Excellent, all right. We're gonna go through that sequence <laughs> one more time. And I, I choose a little bit too much weight on that one. So I'm gonna mix it up and go a little bit lighter for my next one. And if you need to do so, feel free to mix it up. You'll see that anytime you need to make it heavier, make it lighter, just make this workout work for you and your fitness level. All right, we're getting back into it. Next set here, second and last one in five, four, three, two, one, zero, that's it. Again, palms stay facing inward, making sure to breathe in and breathe out. And yes, this is gonna totally annihilate those triceps, the back of your arms. That's on purpose. That burning sensation that you're feeling, that's how we know it's working. Halfway point. You gotta keep pushing through. When it gets tough, when the moves get tough, you need to be tougher. Remind yourself of what brought you here today. What was it that made you start this video, start this workout? Hold on to it. It's what's gonna get you through, right here. Almost there. And last one. And let's pulse it. Nice little pulses. There we go, keep it going. Make sure should breathe. Come on, fighting through it, fighting through it. All right, guys, here we go in three, two, one, and hold. That's it, try to get your best to keep those elbows at a 90. We're right there with you, Has Fit Tribe. You can see Ooh. me shaking, come on, let's go. Don't stop when it hurts, stop when you're done. Come on, finish strong, finish strong, there almost go, there. guys, in three, two, one, break. Ooh, I felt that one, nice work. All right, we have one last superset, and we're actually gonna go back and forth between your biceps and your triceps. We recommend choosing a little bit lighter weight for this one, just so you're prepared. We're gonna do three sets of each of these moves, starting with a dumbbell clutch curl. We're gonna do three sets of 15 of each move. Good posture, shoulders are back, palms are facing inward. Now we're gonna keep those palms facing in as we allow our elbows to come out to the side. Dumbbells together, all the way up all the way down, again, nice and controlled for 15 repetitions. We're just doing a little burnout here, a lot of repetitions at the end, just gonna finish off those arms. Getting a lot of work in in a short period of time today. You've made it this far, just keep fighting, just keep moving. You got it. Again, breathing in, 
on the way down and breathing out on the hardest part of the move as you curl those dumbbells up. Squeeze those dumbbells up at the top every time. We're almost there. Breathing in. You have two more. Here it is. And last one. All right, now you can choose to use the same weight or mix it up, but we're gonna go into an overhead tricep extension. Pop those dumbbells straight up overhead, trying your best to keep good posture, keep those elbows in as we lower the dumbbells and raise them back up, extending your arms straight up. Nice and controlled all the way up, all the way down for 15 reps. You got it right here, everybody. We're fighting and burning with you. You gotta keep moving. Focus on what brought you here today. Whether it's more toned arms, stronger arms, you're just trying to get better at life in general. Five more. Whatever it is, just stay focused on it. Almost there, fighting through that burn. Here we go, here we go. Come on, you got it. All day, you got Last it. Last one. Excellent, okay. Right back into the biceps now. Triceps oh, are resting. Gracious. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Clutch curl. Biceps are working now. Like I said, at any point in time, if you need to switch up your weight, either making it heavier or lighter, feel free to do so. You don't need our permission. Make this workout work for you. Again, squeeze those dumbbells up at the top, squeezing your biceps. Elbows come out to the side. You got it. Here we are. Every repetition, getting you just that much closer to the end and just that much closer to your goals. Five more. That's it. Come on. Fighting through. Made it this far. No giving up now. You got it. Come on. If you can do this, you can do anything. It's all about that mental toughness right here. Last one. Where are you at? All right. Let's nice. go, Hasfit Tribe. Let's get those triceps next. You know the drill. Pump them up overhead right into it that's it biceps are work are resting while those triceps are working nice keep breathing whatever you do do not hold your breath all right third of the way through that's it come on <laughs> just three sets of each of these and your arms are done come on that's it Ooh, they're starting to get heavy we're feeling it too five more Come on, focus on what brought you here today. What is it? Come on, what's it gonna take to get there? Doing at least one thing every day to get you just Last that much one. closer. Come on, <sighs> one more of each. Oh, come on, goodness Hester gracious. Tribe. We got it, shake those arms loose. Let's go, come on. You got it, you got it, right here. These five pounders are starting to feel like 100, 30 pounds. 105? Yes. <laughs> come on, that's it. If you gotta switch to just using your arms or using some water bottles. Whatever you gotta do, just finish right here. Think about how good you're gonna feel when this workout is all done and you can cross this off your list. Think about what would happen if you just stopped working out and never worked out again. What would the consequences be of that? That's not something that you wanna move forward with. That's why you're here putting in the work. That's number 12 right there. That's it, 13, almost there, last two. 14, squeeze them. Last one, 15. Here we are, Whew. last set. Finishing strong, finishing together. Let's go, Hasfit Tribe. Come on. Ooh, those arms are getting more toned, more lean muscle with every rep. Not all about vanity, but hey, I'd be remiss if I didn't remind you how good those arms are gonna look in a tank top. Come on now, let's hit it, rep by rep. Getting that much closer. Keeping good posture, full range of motion. Five more. Come on, fighting through, fighting through. Almost there. And two. One, last one. Zero. Set oh. those dumbbells down. We're gonna get started with a strength move. We're gonna do okay. some Arnold presses and we're gonna do four sets. We're gonna start with a set of 12, a set of 10, a set of eight, and then a set of six, and we're gonna work our way up in weight as we go. So we're gonna start with your lightest weight for a set of 12 repetitions. So we're gonna start with our 
arms up, hands up in rack position. So curl those dumbbells up by your shoulders. Now we're gonna press the dumbbells up overhead while at the same time we twist and rotate those palms until they're forward, finishing with our biceps by our ears. Then rotate, reverse, back down for 12 repetitions. All right, here we go and begin. Full press all the way up overhead and control the movement on the way back down. So you'll see throughout today's routine that we're really gonna focus on that time under tension and controlling the weights as we press and as those dumbbells go through that eccentric or lowering phase as well. Nice and controlled. Keep a little bend in your knees, core stays tight on this one. I'm gonna burn those shoulders out today. I'm excited, are you excited, Claudia? I am. Get it going. Nice and controlled on this first set of 12. You have three more. Breathe in on the way down and then exhale on the way up as you press. And again, twist those palms until those palms are facing forward. And we have last one right here. All right, make it count. Full range of motion all the way up, all the way down, controlled and relaxed. Okay. so. Because we are going a little heavier on this first set, we're gonna take a slightly longer break, so allow those shoulders to recover a little bit. We're gonna choose our weight for the next set. So we're Correct. doing a set of 10 repetitions. Now ideally on this one, you'd be moving up anywhere between uh, 15 to 20% in weight, but you're really gonna have to make this workout your own and also base it off of uh, the weights that you have. Exactly, what you have access to at home. Exactly, so you might not be going up every time. All right, here we go. Next set, 10 repetitions, up in rack position, and begin. Nice and controlled on the way up and on the way down. Again, not a race on this one. This isn't a hit routine. It's all nope. about that strength and muscle building. Really need those muscles to take over, not just your joints and momentum. Good, good posture. Keep the core nice and tight and engaged throughout. So that means actually halfway point flexing those core muscles. This one's working really your entire shoulder. Great compound move as you come all the way up and all the way down. And as the name suggests, this was popularized by, by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Two more. Almost there. Come on, fight through that burn, guys. Burn starting to kick in. Definitely. Last, Last one. one. Ooh, and control all the way down. Excellent. Okay. Ooh. Set those dumbbells down again. Shaking out your arms. Shake them out. Shake them out. We got our next set of eight repetitions. Yep. So I'm going up and wait again. Um, I'm thinking staying about it. Staying the same, or know. what are you I'm doing? Nope. Claudia's we... staying the same for this one. So we have eight reps. Actually, I think uh, I'll go up a little bit. <laughs> and as you can see, the you know the more you do these workouts, the better you'll get at figuring out exactly what weight is appropriate for you. All right, start again. Next set of eight. Curl those dumbbells up by your chin. A little bend those knees, and then full range of motion. Control both ends. You got it. Making sure to breathe throughout. One of the great things about setting up your reps the way that we're doing is like the twelve and. The, the sets of 12 and 10 repetitions are more hypertrophy for muscle building. And then these heavier sets of eight and six are better for strength. So it kind of gives you the best of both worlds. Two more. Challenges those muscles. Here we go. Last one coming up after this. Last one, make it count, come on. Finish strong, excellent, all right. Ooh. We got one last set. Again, I'm going to go up just a little bit more for this last set of six. I think I'm going to stay where I'm at. And you decide what is right for you. Pushing yourself, but at the same time, trying your best to keep proper form. Yes. I'm going to get started here in five seconds. Shake those arms out. Let's make a count here. In three, two, one, zero, begin. Again, full range of motion on the way up and on the way down. And as this burn starts to kick in, you gotta remind yourself, what brought you here today? What is it? Halfway point. What are you working on? Stay focused on it. Control that descent. 
Here we go. Last one right here. And Ooh. Ah, zero, excellent. Up next, we're gonna perform a superset. We're gonna go back and forth between a military press and a drag row. But we're gonna start with that military press. We're gonna do each exercise for a set of 12, 10, and then eight repetitions using a similar technique as we used last time. So a military press is just a, a your most standard basic overhead shoulder press. So again, curl those dumbbells up into rack position, palms facing forward, little bend in those knees, dumbbells by your shoulders. We're gonna press straight up overhead, extend those arms, and then again, control that lowering face back down to the dumbbells are about in line with your ears. Here we go, 12 repetitions and begin. Again, I really want you to control the weight throughout. You may get tired of hearing me say that today, but it's so important. And then as we get fatigued, it becomes more tempting to let momentum take over, but we really wanna enjoy the results that come along with this routine today. Otherwise, there's no reason to even do it. Again, breathe in on the way down, breathe out as we press up overhead. This is your halfway point. Six down, six to go, come on. Last five. You got it. Pushing through right here. Get that core tight and engaged. Again, this one's really working all three of your deltoid heads. Control that descent. And last one right here. Finishing strong. And zero. Woo. Excellent. Okay, I'm burning Feel and that. on fire. Okay, so the next one is going to be, I'm going to use the same Me weight. Me too. It's gonna be, but you can change if you need to. We're gonna do a dumbbell drag row. So keeping those dumbbells in close to our sides, our palms are facing inward. Now we're gonna keep those dumbbells up against our sides as we drag them up and pull up from the elbow. So the, to the naked eye, this looks a lot like a shrug, but we don't want your traps to take over. This one's really gonna hit the medial deltoid of your shoulder. So as we pull up and keep those dumbbells up, we're pulling up from the elbows. Let's hit it for a set of 12 and three, Two, one, begin. Again, pulling all the way up. I'm pretty sure this one forces you to have the most unattractive face at the top. <laughs> Do a screen grab from this for the thumbnail. But it's effective. Pulling up from those elbows, keep the shoulders back. Nice and controlled on this one. All the way up, all the way down. It's a unique move that kind of hits the medial deltoids from a different angle than they're used to getting hit from. Pairs nicely with that military press. Again, we have 12 in total. Almost there. You have three more after this. And on this one, you're breathing out on the way up and then in on the way down. So for every exercise, you're trying to exhale on the hardest part of the move. And last one, zero, good. Okay, so we can set those dumbbells down if you, for the next one, if you're gonna go up and wait, which I am for that military press, set of 10 repetitions on this next one. Shake out those shoulders in between. And again, ideally you're going up and wait between about 15 to 20%. Everybody always wants to know numbers, but it's so difficult because everybody's different. That's and right. Everybody has access to different dumbbells. You have to make it your own. Let's go ahead and curl those dumbbells up to our shoulders, right back into that military press. Let's begin. All the way up, all the way down for 10 reps. Breathe. This one, breathing in on the way down and then exhaling as you press straight up. A slight bend in those elbows. I'm sorry, in those knees. You got it. Pushing through everybody. Halfway point. Come on. And it's not about being perfect today. If you need to lower your weight, that's okay. Feel free to do so. It's just about getting through, getting the work in right here. Whew, I'm burning. I like it though. Learning to love that burn right here. Last one right here. Push through and control that descent. Zero, whoo, excellent. Wow, I was burning. Okay, I'm gonna change my weight a little bit for this next set of drag rows. Again, 10 repetitions on this next one. You decide what, which weight is appropriate for you. Shake those arms out. Okay. We're gonna get it going here in five, four, three, 
two, one, zero. Good posture. Dumbbells on your sides and pull up from your elbow. It's like you have a string attached to those elbows and somebody's pulling you straight up with it. Just for a little mental visualization there. Good. Core stays tight. Good posture on this one. Don't bend over or lean back. You got it. Pushing through. Think about how good you're going to feel when this workout's all done. You can cross this one off your list for today. Every repetition is getting you just that much closer to your goal. Three more. Almost there. Finishing this set strong. Let's go. Last two. Right here. Right here. Breathing in and breathing out. Last, Last one. one. Come on. And zero. That's Ooh, it. All right. One. I'm going to go a little heavier for my next set of military press. Last set of eight repetitions. I'm going to push the pace a little bit on this one. You decide which weight is appropriate for you. Use those legs to pick up the dumbbells. Make yep. sure you're not just as using the back. Yep. That's right. Especially, even more important as they get heavier. Okay, curl them up. Up by your shoulders. And here, let's hit it. A little bit in those knees. Last set. Right here, control the way up and the way down. Last set of eight repetitions. Excellent job. Nice and under control. I know as it gets heavier, no shoulders burn. You just want to race through it, but stop yourself right here. Come on. Let's go. Pushing Two more. through. Pushing through. Last one. Ah, zero. Excellent. Oh, no goodness. more military presses. You can cross those off your list. Getting ready for that last Check. set of drag rows. Last set of eight should be your heaviest set. If you've been working up, oh, my shoulders are already feeling good. Boulders for shoulders. Let's go. <laughs> shoulders are back. Good posture. Let's get it going in five, four, three, two, one, and up. Keeping those dumbbells nice and tight to your sides. I even got a little sweat going. Feels good. Warm in the gym today. Come on, pulling up on those elbows, every repetition, fighting through that burn. Four more. Remember, you don't have to listen to that burn, pushing past it. Your shoulders may be telling you no more, but you're in charge. Come on. Two more. Almost there, almost there. Pull them up, keep those dumbbells nice and tight to your sides. Ooh last one. And all the way up, squeeze back down, nice. <sighs> This is our last superset, so you're almost there. Let's do it. We're gonna go ahead and move your chair, bench, box, whatever you're using out of the way. We don't need it for this last one. We're gonna go back and forth between a dumbbell lateral raise and an upright external rotation. All right, let's go ahead and get started with that lateral raise. With both of our dumbbells, feet are shoulder width apart. We're gonna bend over on a 45 degree angle. Elbows are bent at a 90 degree angle. Now we're gonna come up, raise those arms until they're parallel to the ground pause and back down. So every repetition, we're gonna pause up at the top and then slowly return back down. We have 15 repetitions for this one. So it's probably a lighter weight, Definitely. especially if this is your first time doing it. Okay, let's get into it here in three, two, one, zero. Coming on up, squeeze and return. That's it, one good, one 1,000 pause up at the top on every rep. This one's gonna hit your medial deltoids as well as your rear deltoids. Really control those dumbbells and accentuate that pause on every rep. Core stays tight, weights back in your hips, may even feel this one a little bit in your legs. That's totally normal. These 15 repetitions, we are gonna get a good lactic acid burn going here. So it's important that you remember that lactic acid is just that fuel that your muscles use when it starts to burn. Five you, more guys. You don't have to listen to it. Just ignore it, push past it. Your fitness is all mental. Right here, come on. Almost there. Squeeze. And you have one more. Come on. 
Zero. Ah, mm. all right. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna go a little bit lighter for this <laughs> next one. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> all right, we have another 15 repetitions coming. No pause on this one, thank goodness. We're gonna go into that external rotation, upright external rotation, bringing the dumbbells up. We had a 90 degree angle at the underarms and at the elbows. We're gonna rotate the hands back and then rotate them forward until those lower arms are parallel to the ground. 15 repetitions, again, under control, a little lighter weight for this one. It's a great move for your rotator cuffs. Okay, let's bring it up and begin. Pull back from your hands while keeping those elbows up. And again, this one's all about being under control. It'd be much easier just to fly through these, but don't do it. Come on, fighting through that burn. You are stronger than that burn right here. Come on, prove it to yourself, everybody. What brought you here today? Come on, let's hit it. Right there with you. Rep by rep. Fighting through, Hasbro Tribe. Let's go. Ooh, goodness. We're all fighting together. We have five more. That's it. Come on. 15 in total. Four. Three. Keep those elbows up. Two. One. Last one. Zero. Oh. Oh my gosh. All right, shake them out. Not much time. Not much break on this one. Adjust your weight if you need to. Again, it's three sets of each of these exercises. One down, two to go. Again, I'm going a little heavier for my, my lateral raises. And I'm gonna stay at the same weight. You decide what is appropriate for you. Either way, bending over 45 degree angle. Come on, let's go right into it, guys. Pulling up from those elbows and squeeze. Don't forget about the pause. Whoops. It's all right. There's a little Freudian slip there. <laughs> Your shoulders wanted you to forget about it. <laughs> squeeze up at the top and pause every time. One, 1,000. That's it, you got it, come on. 10 more. Nothing can stop you right here, right now. Come on, exceeding your own expectations. That's it. Just you versus you. Woo! Defeating the you who couldn't get it done yesterday, but tomorrow, today, you are stronger. Come on. Five more. Let's go, right here. You got it, you got it. Control that descent. Come on, you can do it. Push through, push through. Burn so good. Come on, we're right there with you. Two more. Last one right here, guys. Ah, oh. ah, there it is, okay. Ooh, you only have one more set of those. Moving to that upright external rotation. Like I said, I'm lowering my weight just a little bit on this one. Another 15 repetitions coming up. Shake them loose. It's Ooh. all about that mental toughness right oh, here. Your that's... shoulders may be telling you no. For real. But you gotta take control. <laughs> You're in control. All right, get those arms up, bent elbows, and let's pull back on those hands. Nice and control. That's it, 15 repetitions. And you may have noticed throughout today's workout that I'm using these power blocks. And they're pretty nice because they allow me to have many different varieties of weights and allows me to switch it up pretty quick and they don't take up a lot of space. If you want more information on those, we do have the link in the video description. We always get questions about them. Come on, let's go right here. Squeeze those shoulders as you come back. Breathe, fighting through that burn. You got it, come on. Almost there. Five more. Maybe thousands, maybe millions of you at home feeling that same burn you're feeling. You're not alone. We're in it together, Hasfit Tribe, come on. Uh, what's that, last one? Last one, more. one right here. One more. Uh, I think I wanted it to be the last one. Okay. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> we have one more of each. Come on, home stretch, everybody. Home stretch. Adjust your weight if you need to. This is it. One Very more last set. set. One more set of each of these shoulder moves. And our shoulders are done. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Dumbbell. Bent over lateral raises. Here we are. Elbows are on that 90 degree angle. And let's begin. Last 15 of these. Pause up to the top. You gotta go to that happy place on this one. Again, this is that point of the workout where it's not even physical anymore. It's just you versus you, your ability to push yourself, push past that pain, 
push that past that desire to hit that pause button and just say, ah, I'm good. But no, finishing through. You start something and you finish it. That's just the type of person you are right here. Come on. Pause up at the top. You got it. Not much left on these Hasfit Tribe. Five more. That's it. Let's go, pushing through. Four more. Three more. Come on. Two, get that squeeze, that pause every time. Every time. Here Last we go. Last one. That's it. Last one. And pause. Ah, <sighs> like it. Burn so good. <laughs> Come on, gotta keep that positive mentality going, that positive attitude. Ooh. Let's go ahead and I'm changing up my weight for this last set. Who knew I would sweat this much for a shoulder workout? Hey, feels good. We're working hard, everybody. That's right. We appreciate you working along with us. Let's knock out this last one. Arms are up. 90 degree angles all around. Pull back on those hands for 15 repetitions. 14 more. 14 more. That's it. Come on. You got it. You've come this far. You. Nothing's gonna stop you now. Nothing's gonna get in your way. Right here. Making sure to breathe throughout. Do not hold that breath. Excellent. Not a race. Control them, control them. Come on. It's all mental. Don't listen to that burn. Pushing past it. Every repetition. Every rep getting you that Five much. Five more. Every rep getting you that much closer to your goals. That's it. Almost there, almost there. Pushing through everybody. Two more. Ooh, here we are, last one. What do you got, what do you got, what do you got? Squeeze, ah. I'll tell you what I have, I have jello arms. <laughs> ah. Nice work. Ooh, high five to you out there. Jeez, if you can lift your arms, then yeah, that was a give rough us high a virtual. Five. Yeah, virtual high five, one of, <laughs> whew, one of those. Thank you so much for working out with us today. Please support our mission to keep these great workouts free by donating to our Patreon page, downloading our app, or by picking up one of our t-shirts or my new book, Stay Fit for Life. And if you enjoyed this workout routine with us today, we ask that you give this video a big thumbs up and hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss another new workout from HasFit. Again, thank you so much for joining us today. I'm Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia. And we will see you at your next workout.